This video doesn't even feel real. Roblox is suing a YouTuber. Hi there, I'm Ruben Sin, a Roblox YouTuber who's currently being sued by the Roblox Corporation. What you're looking at on the screen right here is probably the biggest Roblox news we're gonna have all year long. Yeah, Roblox, the multi-billion dollar company, is suing a YouTuber for 1.6 million dollars. Who's demanding all of the money I've ever made from YouTube and Patreon, that all of my social media accounts be deleted that all of my Roblox videos be deleted, and that I pay Roblox $1.6 million. And a Roblox YouTuber who has 700,000 subscribers, and the lawsuit has some crazy allegations against it. So earlier today, Bloxy News, they tweeted, Break, Roblox is suing YouTuber Ruben Sim for temporarily shutting down the 2021 Roblox Developers Conference with a fake, I, I can't say that word here on YouTube. A lot of people took this complaint at face value and actually believe everything Roblox accuses me of. Business Insider tried to reach Roblox for comment, and they responded with, The filing speaks for itself. We have nothing further. Benjamin Robert Simon, better known as Ruben Sim, is a very controversial YouTuber. He started his career by uploading videos about Roblox, most of them playing games or about his opinions, especially the terrible moderation team Roblox has. His channel became famous when, in June of 2017, he made a video exposing Mr. Obvious, a cartoonist, for committing pedophilic acts against several children. Fast forward to September 2021, he was banned again from Roblox for cursing and abusing voice chat. However, this ban ended up creating controversy, due to a video of him showing other developers cursing, abusing and even making sexual sounds in voice chat. Unfortunately, in November of that same year, Roblox Corporation filed a lawsuit against Ruben Sim. Today, I bring you this video to summarize the history after the lawsuit. Roblox accused Benjamin of several horrible acts, such as posting misleading terrorist threats to discourage people from attending events in person, glamorizing the YouTube headquarters shooting in April 2018, cyberbully Roblox Corporation employees and executives, repeatedly violate Roblox terms of use, and many more accusations. The vast majority of the accusations were vehemently denied by Ruben Sim who maintained his innocence throughout the legal proceedings. The Roblox Corporation wanted Ruben Sim to pay them $1.6 million, an amount of money too high for Benjamin to pay. Upon receiving information about the lawsuit, most of the Roblox community despised it, because of its various lies and the injustice that had been done to Ruben Sim. However, for Ruben, there wasn't much he could do since Roblox had sued him. At the moment, he was only able to join the battle against Roblox. In January 2022, the lawsuit ended. Most of the charges against Benjamin were dismissed by the court. However, they ordered him never to enter the Roblox platform again, and that included not creating accounts or playing any experiments. At least, he can still log in to the roblox.com website. He also made a deal with the Roblox Corporation and had to pay the still absurd sum of $150,000 to the company. However, surprisingly, no consequences were sent to the Roblox Corporation, who, as I mentioned earlier, possibly tried to tarnish Benjamin's reputation by telling the court several lies. After the lawsuit was finished, Benjamin continued to make his videos, but with much more limited content, because he could no longer play Roblox legally. Nowadays, Ruben Sim mostly makes videos about Roblox, but sometimes it's into other games like Gary's Mod. Ruben also has a Twitter account, 
set up to help Roblox moderation delete any content that breaks the platform's rules. Roblox Corporation came out as the villain at the end of the story, with its reputation, which was already bad for many reasons, getting worse. In short, Roblox lost parts of the lawsuit against Benjamin. However, Ruben Sim also had consequences that still impact today. And with this, we come to the end of the video. I hope very much you enjoyed it. If you liked the content, leave a like, share it with your friends and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss the next videos that I'll make soon. If you have any topic suggestions for future content, leave them in the comments below. Thanks for watching and see you soon. Ooh.